of VIP Beauty Hair. They are an AliExpress vendor. They sent me out four bundles and a lace frontal of the lengths 24, 26, 28, 28, and then a 20 inch frontal, okay? Okay, so they sent the hair to me via FedEx. It did take um three days. It took them three days to get it to me, so which that was good. The packaging, it was standard. Y'all know how most AliExpress companies do. They're trying to be too special. They just put it in a nice little plastic Ziploc bag with the bundles inside. And then of course, each bundle had the sticker giving you the uh, lengths on top. Right, I forget everything out. The bundles were, um, the bundles were nice. The bundle size were nice. Now, since I do have long lengths, everything fit okay so i have everything stuffed in my head now of course if you have uh shorter bundles then you definitely should be able to get away with three bundles in the front too. but y'all know me like i always say y'all y'all know me by now i don't even know why i keep telling y'all this i have to go extra um i did wash the hair there was no dyes coming out yeah everything seemed good with the web construction and how the hair was when i first got it also i did not have any smell it just smelled like I don't wanna say factory, but I guess like a hair factory, like it just smelled like hair, but not bad. And so the maintenance for me when it comes to this hair, the maintenance is on my scale of low, medium, or high. I would give it a medium maintenance for me because the curls, I don't know if it's because the longer the, uh, the, longer the inches, the looser the curl is, but as you can see, the curls are loose. Um, it's like a loose curl. And it's not hard to maintain and take care of. It's not hard for me to detangle my hair at all. Now, I do wanna tell y'all that I did sleep with this hair. I've actually slept with this hair two nights in a row, okay? Cause I do have my frontal um, glued to my forehead, as you can see. <laughs> I do have it glued down with the got to be glued. Um, and then of course I did my baby hairs with, um, I didn't do it with the equal style, I did it with foaming lotion. I love doing it with foaming lotion because even though they're set, they're not hard, so if you want to play with them and move them around, it's not hard to move them around, but anyway. Yeah, I slept with this for two days. Now, and what you're seeing here is two-day-old curls. Only thing I did to this hair was add water to it. I have not added any products. The only thing that I have done to this hair since I've had it is co-wash it, um, and that's it. I have not added any products. Y'all know I don't like products, and this is how I'm looking. Now, of course, if you want your hair to be more tame, you're gonna want to add products to your hair. Um, because this hair gets big, it gets really big throughout the day. Um, and that's what I like. That's why I don't add any products. Um, Cause I like my hair to get big and I, I like it to be as free and flowy as possible as you can see. The only thing that I did to maintain my curls was wrap my hair up in a high ponytail. And then um, I, of course I put a silk scarf around my 
edges or baby hairs to preserve those. So it's, when I'm telling you, these baby hairs have been like this since I've been sleeping in this hair for two days. Um, and then I put a silk bunny on top of my um, big pineapple. So of course my curls were smushed, but when I took everything out and then added a few spritz of water, not even a lot of water, this is what I got, okay? Now detangling this hair, as you can see, I can run my fingers through. I don't like to, but I can do that. It gets little, uh, it gets caught up, of course, because it is curly hair. But as you can see, it's not hard to separate the curls. I only have to co-wash this hair once a week. Now, I do like to do it twice a week sometimes when I'm feeling fancy. Um, but for the most part, once a week can suffice. Honestly, with the men on this wig, taking it on and off, really, you can get away with doing it maybe every two weeks. But... If you have it as a sew in, and of course, if you like how your curls feel um, soft and clean and you know, refreshed, um, I would at least co wash it once a week. Y'all know that's what I always do. I just feel like once a week is good. But of course, um, you can do it however you want to do You can do whatever floats your boat. Okay, shedding and tangling. Um, I do receive shedding. I do receive not tangling, but snagging. Um, shedding, of course, is not bad. The only reason why I receive shedding is because. Um, I'm pretty sure it's not the only reason, but um, it is curly hair. So when I detangle my hair, uh, it does shed because it's intertwining all the curls or interlocking with each other. So, I mean, you should expect shedding. Now, can I say that uh, the shedding is massive? No, it's not. I would say that I get a, I would say I get a small amount of shedding. Like if I detangle my hair daily, it's on a low scale, but if I go days, it can be like a medium scale, but it's nothing alarming. The amount of shedding that I receive, I know for a fact I would not be missing any of that hair, okay? Um, tangling, again, it doesn't necessarily tangle, it just snags. I don't receive any matting in the back. It can snag and interlock in the back because it's a lot of hair in the back. And then of course it uh, it's rubbing against my clothes. So I mean, of course it, it can bunch up, but let me see if y'all can see. This is how I'm looking at. I've had this hair again. I've worn this, I swear to goodness, nonstop. I slept in this for two days, okay? And that's how my back is looking. I didn't have to go in and do nothing like that. I actually didn't even touch my, my nape at all. So this is how I'm looking, just so y'all can see. This is the natural color of the hair that it came in. I did not dye this hair. I did not do anything to alter this hair at all. What you see is how it came and that's all I did. I have not done any coloring at all. I did bleach my front of course, and I, um, you know, customized it. And the hairline on this one, it wasn't completely like fully dense. Um, it had like a small, of course, in the front. It did have it where it was um, thin down a little bit, but you still had to go in and do some plucking. I did a lot of plucking, actually. I did a lot of plucking. Um, it didn't take me too long, but then again, it could have. I had my music on, my earbuds, so when I was plucking, I was going away singing, so it didn't even phase me that it was a long time. Um, but I did have to do a lot of plucking. Like, I had a nice chunk of hair. Um, but the hairline in the front was thinned out, so you can, you know, play around with it to your like. And I wish that I did have a picture. I do apologize. I know I'm trying to get better at showing you all how things come for the most part. Um, and last but not least, my opinion on the longevity. Y'all know how I do. I do it for my wig lovers and my sewing lovers. So for my wig lovers, I feel like this hair should last you between, um, I would actually say four months to six months. Now, of course, I do always feel that if you're not wearing this hair all the time and you're going back and forth with different units, this hair can definitely last you up to a year because you're not doing much to it at all, of course. But if you're wearing this nonstop every day, I honestly feel like this hair should last you between four to six months because the curls really are nice quality. Like, they don't feel cheap. They don't feel rough. They It feels like it's nice quality, in my opinion. Um, especially if you're not adding any products and if you are adding products you're definitely co-washing um, on a regular routine I feel like it should last you a good time and for my sew-in lovers I would say this hair should last between uh, two to six months as well now for the the bundles that I have in my head right now if you had these bundles which VIP beauty should definitely be sending you the same bundles okay VIP beauty please Please send them the same bonus if they decide to get this hair because, you know, we all want the same quality. But if VIP Beauty sends you the same quality bonus that I have, I honestly feel like it should last you between at least two to four months. But if you are able to take care of it and um, not have to do a lot of manipulating to it, and I feel like it should last you between two to six. 
um, just depending on whatever you do with it. That's just my opinion, okay? But yeah, I do thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, again, if you all have any questions, comments, or concerns to me, please don't hesitate to leave them down below for me and I will get to you all as soon as I can. And I hope you all have a great day or night whenever you all are watching this. And I will talk to you guys very, very soon. Mm -hmm. Bye, y'all.